It's grandma's birthday. Da, 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 I, I have I have to shout out to my grandma Emerson, Mrs. Lily Lewis. I got dressed up as I like an leopard. Yeah, I look made an leopard today. Does that piss you off even more? Oh God, I can't fucking wait. One day I'm a Trump, then I'm a lady, I'm lady of the Trump, and then I'm a trampolino. You are not good enough, Joanne. You're a disgrace. Grandma is disgusted. She's over the. We're all. It's a very bittersweet time because we're just like. I mean, particularly Grandma at the time when she was alive, she knew what she didn't know. Like me, I know what I don't know. We all know what we don't know. You don't know what you don't know at the, you know at the right time. You only know what you know at the time. What you need to know at the time. You don't need to know that. My Grandma used to say, I'm having two breaths. I'm eating for two today. I'm, I'm giving birth to my Grandma. So I'm eating for her and me. So I'm having double toast with four slices in one day. <laughs> I don't care, I'm hungry. I've been busy. When I'm on R&R, &R, finally, I can relax. It's done. I've told, oh, there's no more dotty dotties left. You've eaten all the jelly dots. And my lovey like jelly dots. You've eaten all the fucking jelly dots. My own consumerism of the masses. So, be nice. What? I used to be like this with my grandma. Grandma, what's going on? How, how can I trust in God? How do I know about this? How do I know I don't fit in? I hate my life. It's not bad, grandma. Catherine, please, just stop thinking. It just is. It'll be fine. Everything always works out. Just lead your life, honestly. Don't hurt anybody else. And it'll be fine. Stop worrying. You're overthinking everything. Catherine, you're going to drive yourself insane. Stop thinking. She used to say to her, everyone knows Grandma did. She didn't say very much, but when she spoke, you should listen. I listened. Fuck that. What had a problem? What, is, what did you say, Grandma? I'm sorry, yes, I listened. Mm -hmm. And then I used to sleep with my grandma because they killed my granddad when he was 64. 64, 64, 64. So he, was like, he was a Harry. That was his name, Harry Emerson. He went to Africa. Now, this is a very significant thing. My grandma would never go to church without a hat. Always had to wear a hat. Oh, she loved the hat. She was a hat. And then every time she used to put one on me, my mother used to get so jealous. We used to like going to the hat shop. We like hats. <laughs> we do. So my mum was like, oh. And I'm like, I used to go in and my mum go, go and have a look. Anyone's like, okay, can I touch them? Yeah. So my mother, don't touch them. Leave her alone, Sandra. She's just trying the hats on, for goodness sake. She's a child. So my grandma used to let me put the hats on. And she go, what do you think of this one? And she got, I've only got a head for any hat. Every hat suits you. She says you look great at hats. I always wear hats. I do wear hats and I wear bandanas. I wear all sorts on my head. So, my grandma was a seamstress. That's a sewer to you. Made clothes. Patient of a saint, I was. She was a Gemini though. Don't start with a fucking Gemini. She'll rip you to fucking bits. She doesn't even say this. She just used to look. Sorry, Grandma, uh, would you like a cup of tea? Grandma, are you okay? Fine. <laughs> when a woman says, that's how I learned it from, if a woman says, fine. If you say to your woman, hey, babe, bab, I'm going to go out for a few binds, is that all right? Fine. Don't move a fucking inch, you get the divorce papers next week. <laughs> what? Okay, it's not fine. I'll stretch a nice day in. Am I allowed to go out just for one bite, two bite, no bites? I'll just stay here, I'll not move. <laughs> Somebody says they're fine, male or female, don't move an inch and really pay attention to what they're going to say next. I'm telling you. It's Lillian's birthday. Family is everything. Family is not blood. Blood is thicker than water. You shouldn't drink the blood. You didn't do a signed Let's Do Blood Brothers, did you? Oh... Children, what have you been doing? This is why the cats are the way the mice would play. It's a good job our Catherine's bloody stayed on the system and worked the system and got an education. University of what was that? The University of York. No, Joanne. Catherine has done what she did. I told Catherine this when she was a child because she used to cry a lot because of you lot of plots of sailing a lot. I used to sleep with my grandma. Grandma, why do you always keep your teeth in when you go to sleep? Normally, when you've got false teeth, they take them out and put them in a jar. That's what they used to do in the films. And my grandma says, Are you joking? 
I know my mom asking you, why don't you take your teeth out? And she says, well, because she says, do you know how old I am? She says, I might die. She says, no way the fucking fireman's coming in my fucking house with no teeth. She did this way. There's no way the fireman's coming and getting me out of my bed dead with no teeth in. I'm going to look good for any of it. I listened to my grandma. I even lied to my grandma and I was naughty with my grandma. When I was a teenager and I came back, fuck, she was mad. And I mean, bad shit, crazy mad. She's a Gemini. Don't fuck a Gemini. I mean, you shouldn't fuck any star sign off because all the star signs of the solar system are a bit la la and can go gaga. You, you really should be careful with every astrological star sign because they all have a little pinch or a plot of a lot <laughs> of crazy in them. Geminis particularly. Well, that's their Geminis. That's a twin. That means they've got two twin. Happy birthday, Grandma. All for you today. School starting. So that's the order of the day now. Just give love, receive love. If you've nothing nice to say, don't speak. It's dangerous to speak. Wow. My grandma's up there. I cannot believe she knew, but she didn't know. And now she can see everything because she's in the She's dead. You don't die. You just change matter. Not a matter of fact. You love never dies. Where do you think Grandma's gone? She's in the fucking wind. Oh, she's in the wind. She's fuming. What you've done to me, she can't believe it. She's even shouted at God. They had a big argument one night. Between them. Spirits. In the, I, went, I wasn't on the spirits. I see this. I know the spirits. My Grandma, when I've been going through what I've gone through the last two years, I said, God, I can't believe you're making her go through this. This is not what we, this is not what I thought it was going to be. I can't believe this. How is she even getting up again? <laughs> God's asleep. I should be fine. She knows what she's doing. She's enjoying herself. <laughs> she's going to thank me later. <laughs> you're welcome. Thank me later. <laughs> it's not meant to make sense. Grandma, this is there. Catherine doesn't have to make It doesn't make sense now. No, it doesn't. I don't think it's a good idea, Catherine, for you to go and find your adopted mother. Not yet. I think you might need to be a little bit more mature. You know... Well, you're going to find your birth mother. I... What about Sandra? Well, I think... Maybe, Catherine, what you should do is just wait a little bit longer. I think you might be a little bit emotional. And I think if you... If you, if you Once you open a can of worms... She used to say this to me, just like this, over breakfast and toast. Just very plainly like this. I'm like my grandma. I grew into my grandma, not my mother. Thank the Lord for that, otherwise we'd all be fucked. If I turn out like my mother, you all be well if the mothers that I've had around me. My real mother's very nice. She's dead as well. <laughs> but... My grandma... I'm just going to say, Catherine, I'm just saying, now listen to what, listen to what I am saying, Catherine. Please, you always call me Catherine, you never call me Cat. Catherine, Catherine, are you listening? If you open a can of worms, you cannot put the worms back in the can. Do you understand what I'm saying? I'm just saying, I'm not telling you what to do. I know I wouldn't tell you what to do. No, I wouldn't tell you what to do. In other words, heaven fucking forbid, because if I told you what to fucking do, you'd do the fucking opposite, and then we'd all be fucked. She, she never listens to any fucking this bloody Catherine. She never swore, though. But that's how I interpret it, because I'm telling you, she was she was wick. Not a prick. She was a seamstress. She'll prick you with a... She's got a thimble on. She'll never get caught. 
and you zap to rain and the electricity made it even worse, more electric. I used to sleep on the night time and I found that I got killed with book from you have a heart attack apparently. But anyway, we did that. I didn't go to the funeral, we went around and please I didn't go really. But it's grandma's birthday, yeah. So I'm celebrating. Nineteen twenty one. That's the year she was born. It's 2024. We made it out alive. Education. It was education like no other. She used to say, sorry, I was going to say that, because I used to cry. Oh, Joanne's this. Because oh, Joanne was the favourite. Oh, everyone loves Joanne. She went to college, you know. She went to university, you know. She didn't have a child until she got married. Do you know what I mean? She's got two houses. Be more like Joanne. No. I'm not going to do that. I don't even want to be like that. She's, I'm not doing that. I'm not. Joanne's doing really well. And the twins. She's still married to Adam. No. Oh yeah, that's a really good idea. So my grandma said, Catherine, please stop getting yourself upset. She says, I'm telling you, everybody has different gifts. There's no need to be upset about it. She says, she's just good at education in the system of earth. She says, Catherine, you've got something. And she says, I tell you what you've got. Not many people have this. What? 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 I don't love my life, grandma. I'm sick of this being really why so much of about <laughs> Tell you what you've got, Catherine. And I'll tell you, Catherine, now listen to my words. Mark my words. You have a rare thing of common sense. Common sense. I'm telling you, she says, not a lot of educated people don't have common sense. You go far in life with common sense. Because common sense is not that common. Lots of people have paper, Catherine, and go to university. You know, many people go to the University of Life and have common sense. It's a rare thing, I'm telling you, she's even good about. Just behave yourself and stop swearing. I'm sick of you swearing. You've got a mouth like a sailor. Could you, could you please try and be more ladylike? Please, please try and be more ladylike, Catherine. But now she's over the other side. She thinks it's hilarious. Just do you. It's great. I just I'm, I'm really quite impressed. <laughs> she said, I would never have done that myself personally. She said, I can't agree with you there because I'm done with you, Catherine. Will you please pull your socks up? You can't have one down and one up. Go and brush your hair. Why have you not brushed your hair yet? Get your other shoe on. Put both shoes on. Why don't you knock your shoes off again, Catherine? Oh, Catherine, you're hard work. This is what she, this is a conversation we used to have. And then on the night time when I used to sleep with her, I used to talk to her for hours. But we used to go to bed. My grandma used to go to sleep at about two o'clock in the morning. She was a night owl. She was a night owl. She suffered with mental health. She never went to sleep. So I used to talk to her for ages and tell me about the war, grandma. What happened in the war? Who did that? Who said that? Who did that? That, 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 that? I know loads of war stories. I do. I paid attention. Right, Kevin, can you please, let's just, I'm closing my eyes now, I, I can't hear you, Kevin, because you, I never stop talking. She says, Kevin, I've got my eyes shut, I can't hear what you're saying, I'm going to go to sleep now. Kevin, I'm not listening, I'm going to sleep. Please, will you go to sleep? Catherine, I'm not going to tell you again. Now, please go to sleep. <laughs> yeah, it'll all work out one day. Just let them, just leave them be. Just let them do what they want to do. So I have a double breakfast today. It's a holy shot of grandma shot. A GG. Go to grandma. <laughs> grandma with glasses. GG. I've been playing the GGs with GG. Grandma with glasses. So my husband. You've all insulted her and been really nasty and there's no way for the family lane, name or lineage. How embarrassing. Catherine, we all have that. There is members of the family that we don't do. <laughs> Hello, family. It was little Robin. See, little Robin's becoming. Family is everything, but she says you do have those members in family where it's a bit like, you know, cousin it. We don't, we don't talk about it. It's cousin it. He doesn't get invited. 
It he can't come where we're going. That is life. I'm going to ask your granddad. He's in the garden. Go and dig some flowers with him. I'm going to ask him if he wants any. And I'll make a hot cross bun or something. Want something to eat? A biscuit? Never went to my grandma's house without being fed. Every time he went in. Here, get some food. Grandma, I don't want anything to eat. You haven't eaten. You're too skinny. I can see you are. I can see you're stressed. I know you're stressed. Grandma, I'm not stressed. Yeah, Catherine, I've never met a more highly stressed person in my whole entire life. She says you need to calm down. <laughs> you're going to blow the cat's skin. Because she was like me, I am now. I never used to be like this. I used to be like you. I was a fucking fire starter. I was a fucking tyrant. You've got to learn. I learn. I grew up. I've upgraded my system. In your computer, it of IT. So what have we been doing on the IT? What are they doing in the system? Ah, uh, now you can't get out of that. Do you have receipts? You, what did you think that was? Bits of paper. It's on the system. That's it. You can't. <laughs> you can try and argue and lie as much as you like, but I can read your system when I see you in the system. The system of this system that you're in now. We're all in the oneness of the system. You and me and I am you, we are we. Wee all the way down. All the way up. Six forty. I was forty four two years ago. I'm now forty six. Whether I am really or not <coughs> makes no difference. It just is because it is what it is. It's just a bell. So I'm saying Happy birthday to my grandmother today. Thank you for being the greatest warrior and inspiration I ever had. I met her on, I went, I used to live in Hampshire, in uh, Portsmouth, down, down south. I, I wanted to go and see my grandma, I got so upset because I wanted to go and spend time with her. She lived at Whitley Bay, next to the beach with the lighthouses. <laughs> they wouldn't let me, and then I, I went, I got, I always get what I want. I always have, really, if you think back, I have. It might be not be what you want, but I always get what I want. I want to go and see my grandma. I'm going to see my grandma. I'm going to go. I'm going on the bus. Catherine, you can't go on the bus. You're nine. But it started when I was about seven. And then I went on about it from seven to eight. And then I got to nine. I grew up to nine. And I said, I'm going. So Sandra, my mother, had to book it. Because I told her to. You will book that. I'm going on the bus. I was nine years of age. And I got put on the bus in London. And I, just by myself, at nine years of age, we were allowed to do things like that then, plus they wanted me to be kicked out because they hated me anyway, because they didn't care, just stick on the fucking bus. So I went on the bus at nine year old on the National Express, and uh, got off at Newcastle and my grandma met me, and I stayed there for a week, just named me grandma, I had a great fucking time. I used to go on the monkey bars, as a tomboy, monkey bars are the bars and you crawl across them. And I used to do it till my hands bled. They used to bleed and uh, my grandma used to be like, Catherine, what have you done? She, I've never known a child in my life, you're bleeding. Why have you not come off and seen me before? Well, because they don't hurt. Catherine, you're really, honestly. And you've got both scabs on your knees now. You fell over again. Come on, we're going in nicely. <laughs> we had a great time. You were always fussing. We went, we used to go to Florence. Well, Auntie Florence. Whose husband went to hospital, he died, and then he just took his body, he signed his body up for science. So when Florence went, this is my grandma's best friend, when uh, Florence went, they said, Oh, I'm ready to bury him, this is where he can't, his body's been used to experiment on it, he's a science, he's a soldier to science. I don't know why I remember that, but I remember that. <laughs> it made me laugh, I said, He's to what? <laughs> He's to what? What? <coughs> I don't know. It's all been funny little things like that. <laughs> we just sit and just watch and we're like, wow, okay, we're doing that today. <laughs> <laughs> so 
So Grandma would like to say thank you very much for everybody who's really supported and uh, looked after Catherine. You've been great family from the from the old um, people can never come back in her life again. Oh, you've got to get through Grandma before you get to fucking Catherine again. I watched what you did. Uh, oh, you even got a black and white cat this morning chasing a ginger roll. I'm telling you, you've got to even just the thought of my Grandma Emerson, Lillian. You've got to get past her first before you get to me. I'm telling you, she's seen everything and she's no, not on her watch. Now, nobody did anything on my grandma's watch without I say so. <laughs> she was a watch of the seamstresses. So apparently I'm in the good books with grandma. Why, grandma? It's her birthday. I'm on the birthday week. Great day yesterday. Had Monday we had the police service, Tuesday we had the fire service, Wednesday is today, it's Odin's day, and today we just, I'm, it's Grandma's day, so I don't know what's going to happen. I'm going out for a bit. And then uh, come back and I don't know what I'm going to do. What are you going to do? I don't know what you're going to do. That's why you should have been in your own lane concentrating. I can flow now because there's nothing to do. I've done everything. I'm, fin I'm on R&R &R now. Yes, I am. Which I have been all the time anyway, but now it's a bit more relaxed. I'm thriving instead of surviving. That's all that's changed. I've done my deep sea diving certificate. I'm an SAS professional coordinated cooperative partnership with my ship. I'm in the mothership with the grandmothers. There's a lot of grandmothers here that you I'm just doing Lillian, Lillian today, it's her day. This is to say thank you, Grandma, for being such a wonderful very grandma and I'm so pleased that we are where we are. And I'm pleased I made all the decisions I made. I regret nothing. I had to be disciplined sometimes and do things I didn't want to do, actually. Close your eyes and think of England, it'll be okay, be over in five minutes, it don't last very long. Kind of vibe. No offence or anything, but it's the fucking truth. Oh god. But we've got and that's what that's life. I was trying to work who are they and who are them and what are they doing? Well, I found out. I had to become the beast to be the beast. And um I went insane in deep into the crevices of my brain. So I went insane to become insane. So I now sane. I've got a sticker. To say I'm insane. 3D insane isn't the same as being my kind of insane. I know. So that's good, isn't it? So carry on doing what you're doing. I hope that's working out for you. I should be with Grandma all day today. I'm going to take her with me. I'm even dressed up for the occasion. Not quite how Grandma was. But she says, actually, Catherine's lovely. I'm very impressed with you. You always do look smart. And you're always clean. Which is the number one thing, darling. As long as you're clean, it doesn't matter. That's what she says to say to the world. I'm channeling Grandma today. And she hates untidiness. And, I, and she wants to say, all this demanding of respect. Well, that's great. But you can't even put your own rubbish in the bin. So when you can learn to put rubbish in the bin, then we might be able to talk about respecting something else. Because you can't respect where you're living. That's why you're living in a stick of the dump. Dump hunters living in a skip rat. You are a skip rat. Living in your own rubbish tip. Of your own consumerism. Look after your things. And they will look after you. Oh no, just get a new one. Chuck it away. Chucking everything away, from phones, to rubbish, to wives, to children, to everything. Just chuck it away. Let's get a new one. Fuck it. Well, good luck with your new one. I hope you're going to like your new life, because this is what you've created with a mess. You've got piss and milk all over the floor. And now you're going to have to clean your mess up, because we don't have a mess on the ship. You went into Mother Shipton's cave. And got stuck in the web of the weaves of the greedy haze of days. Instead of getting on the mothership and having what I said. 
faith and belief in the unseen. How do I know? I used to say that. Like, how, do, how do you know that? It's just because I just know because I trusted. I don't need to go and talk to your granddad's grave. He's here all the time. Just with me. I just know he is. Why, Catherine, you don't need to question everything. Please stop questioning. So I'm reteaching and that's Grandma's message. She used to tell everybody, but nobody listened to her neither. And they said she was fucking crazy with that. So I'm crazy with the grandmas and the GGs. I've done the GGs. You had a bet on the GGs of Grandma. You don't take Grandma on and win. Never. Did you ever win, Lillian? No. She always won. Come have some dinner. Make some meat. Had a good day, girls. Boys. Mm -hmm. I'll do the dishes, don't worry. It's a disgrace. Catherine, open the back door for me, please. I'm getting hot. Now, you can live with her. And I don't care because I made my ancestors proud. And it's not just Grandma. I mean, I'm just studying doing Grandma's day. Because she was the best one for me in this 3D realm. She was the most helpful person that I remember. We had our arguments, don't get us wrong, we had an argument one day and she said and never in my life is any money. <laughs> she was a Gemini, don't fuck with a Gemini. That's yin and yang. They get very angry to the Geminis. If you if you get on the wrong side you she might just run motherfucker so I had a big because I'm a cat and she's a fish, so we kind of. And I, we loved each other, but then when we didn't, we didn't, because I, my back bit would come out and her dark bit would come out. Are you, what did you say, Catherine? What did you say? <laughs> Never in my life has anybody ever ever spoken to me like that. You know how old I am? <laughs> I shocked even my grandmother. That is no way to speak to another human being. <laughs> I can be a bit of a bitch as well if you want me to be. I learned from the best because my grandma was a bitch as well, but she was a subtle bitch. Oh, she was like a. Well, I don't know. Like a soft cushion of a duvet of duck and down. Duck, put you down. Very soft and nice, but like a titanium. Uh, so we're celebrating grandma's birthday i'm having a great time already and it's only half past nine so i'm gonna go enjoy the day i'm gonna go and see which service we need today i'm not sure what we're doing today anywhere on the planet i'm just flowing with the currency current of the what's not against like a salmon and always little dog i'm not the fish i'm the catfish the lie. Oh, I got one. I think I might leave a comment on this one. <laughs> wow, it's such an amazing rain. Who are you? Are you? Are you? No, no, no. Is that true? Because you said it, and I agreed with it. Because if that's that's true. I'm just saying. Where did you get the idea from? Who did you steal that from? Who are you pretending to be? And why is that on my ID? But ah, please answer the questions on the back of a postcard. <laughs> fifty fifty. Phone a friend. Phone a lawyer. <laughs> phone help. Et photo. Oh, that's a lot. Odin, what a sin. On Odin's day, on Grandma's 29, today, birthday is today. On the 5th, 24. You're meant to respect your elders. Whether they're good or bad, or they're still good and, and bad. It's, no, it's just a lesson, really. But Grandma was a good lesson. She was sweet. She wasn't a sourpuss. I enjoyed Grandma. And now I think you've got some explaining to do. A lot of people have got some explaining to do. I say, sweetie. And my granddad Harry says, Lily's always right. 
chilling. My grandma's a man of no words. <laughs> he's not, he doesn't speak very, his presence is here. Not Odin Harry. My granddad Harry never had to speak. Grandma did the speaking. <laughs> she was like me, she never shut up anything well. <laughs> she cooked up a storm all the time. It's just moving her eyebrow. Really? Who said that to you, Catherine? What did they say? Did she? Ah. Mm, I am. <sighs> yes, Catherine, you've been speaking for two hours now, and I completely understand what you said about all of them, Big Bum. Yes, I do know what you're saying, darling. Now go and have a rest, and I'll get you some ice cream. Go to sleep. Might be your ice cream for breakfast. <laughs> I know what you're saying, Catherine. Well done. Just please go to sleep, because you do talk an awful lot. <laughs> <laughs> Try and just rest. <laughs> this is my grandma, that's what she used to say. This is what she used to do, this a lot. G Catherine, I understand what you're saying. It's okay. Just, it'll work out. Just keep doing what you're doing, because that is that is a good idea, Catherine, yes. Yes, Catherine, I understand. She's, she's the only one who actually agreed with it and knew what I was talking about without saying a word. Yes, Catherine, I understand what you're saying. Now just let them. And you keep doing that. You'll be fine, kid. Don't worry about it. My little flower. You're my treasure. She says, you're my treasure. She used to call me a treasure. I was the favourite one, but no, everybody hated me. That's why they didn't like it, because Grandma was, was Grandma's favourite. This is why. Hey, plus, tea's crossed. I think tea is crossed. <laughs> Who's tea? Oh, many teas. Many teas of the weebie deedies. <laughs> Heelies. <laughs> yes, don't swear, Catherine. Behave when you're channeling me. Okay, Grandma. You see, even now she doesn't. She doesn't like swearing. My Grandma does not like swearing. She's very common. We don't do that. Apparently. But that depends. When Odin or my boys come back through, it might be a little bit more. But Grandma does not do that. Yeah, it's her birthday, so you have put some respect on today. No swearing. I think I'm going to get wrong already. You always swear, Catherine. You've always been like a sailor. I've told you, I'm going to wash that mouth out with bloody soap and water. You're going to have to stop if you want to be respected. I told you this since you were three. <laughs> conversation with the uh, with Kat, Emma and Lillian today this morning at the Emerson's of the uh, respectful aristocrats we just put on a good act we know how to behave it's just we let him have a lot of fun but she will she knows what to do when to do it and how to do it so just get in your own lane and leave our Catherine alone she's got to get through grandma to get through me you don't know what her soul is or where her soul was from. Just Lillian. Lily of the Valley. It's one of the lilies that survives on the rocks and can survive any terrain. And now you've got our Catherine. The Eye of Tiger Lily. Good luck, Earth. <laughs> You're going to need it. <laughs> You're not prepared for Catherine. <laughs> she nearly put Grandma in an early grave. <laughs> Happy birthday, Grandma. We did it.